Hey everyone, Rachel here from Today Joyce. Please excuse my voice, I'm losing my voice. I waited as long as I could to film this video, but I have to do it today. So today, I am participating in the what's in my fill in the blanks stockings. So for me, it's gonna be what's in my kids stockings. So this is another collab and a bunch of ladies are going to be participating so be sure to check the playlist below. Some people don't have kids or some people are going to be sharing their husband's stockings or their pets or whatever. So if you want to see what people put in their stockings be sure to check that playlist below. So if you're new here I wanted to welcome you. Thank you for stopping by if you came from one of the other channels or you just found me on YouTube from a search. I am a mom to four. We homeschool, we live in a log home, and we try to do things more naturally. And I welcome you for stopping by. So I am going to show you what I put into my four kids' stockings. I have a 10-year-old, I have an almost nine-year-old, a three-year-old who will be four in March, and a one-year-old who will be two in January. So I have a wide range of ages. So let's get started. And again, please excuse my voice. I waited to film this video, but it has to be done today. My videos, I don't have a hoarse voice in all of them, so I hope you'll keep joining me. Okay, I finally got it all filled up. Don't give me a thumbs down because I probably gave them too much. And I'm gonna be okay with that because we just do a five gift Christmas and I like to buy them gifts. And so I probably went a little bit overboard, but don't kill me. I think they're gonna love it all. So let me show you what I put in their stockings. And P.S. I had to move into my daughter's room because the sun was coming into my face and all shine brights everywhere. So I moved from my son's room to my daughter's room. Hopefully the doors are locked and nobody comes in or they can't hear me downstairs in the homeschool room. All right, I am going to start off with youngest to oldest. And first up is my one-year-old, almost two-year-old in January, Kobe. Here is Kobe's stocking, and I guess I'll just pull it out and show you what I got as I go. So I got him this Paw Patrol um, stainless steel cup. We can never have enough of these, and sometimes we lose them or whatever, so we can never have enough of these. I think he's gonna love it. He's been liking um, having stuff that the big kids have. Got him this kids Jason's fluoride free toothpaste. He's got one of these mess free markers sets and I really like these because he likes to use markers and then it doesn't get all over. It just the color goes directly onto the page and then they have lots of fun. Sorry about my voice you guys. Okay I got him one of these grow and glow dinosaurs and I know it says not for kids under three so we will put it in water and I'll watch it grow together and check it out how it's working and I think he'll think it's cool. Here are his toothbrushes to go with his toothpaste. Got him a Hot Wheels car and then this tape. I thought this was cute. It is a Paw Patrol little bank and all my kids have one and he doesn't have one yet and so I thought this was cute. What else do we have in here? Okay. Got him a little towel and it opens up into the car's sky. Two things left. Got these Paw Patrol little socks. Oops, there's a little Paw Patrol guy. And then I got him the Lightning McQueen. It's kind of like a, what is this called? Like a plush pillow. And it, oh, you bang it. And it makes noise. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think he's going to love all of these things. Okay, next up is my daughter, London. She is three and she will be four in March. So she's almost four and this is what I got for her. 
Oops, she's really been into Shopkins. And so I got her this same mess free marker kit and then, you know, then they can color and there's no mess. She has a little Minnie Mouse brush. She has this frozen sing-along microphone. Makes lots of noise. Sing along with your favorite song to Frozen. Okay, I got her the Trolls water bottle. She really likes Trolls too. She got a Bell towel. Since she's into Shopkins, I got her one little Shopkin. And it has, it's called a Cutie Car Shopkins. And it's like a little car with a little Shopkin character so we'll be careful not to let our little my little guy get this she has a toothbrush and she has this tom's fluoride free strawberry toothpaste i got each of them a different toothpaste flavor so then we can keep it in their little container and then we don't have to fight over who ha whose toothpaste is whose or what anything like that it's all about solving problems for moms huh Let's see what else we got in here we got a shopkins stamp set i thought these were really cute it's like, I don't know what material it is, but it's not something that can break. And it's bracelets for her. It does have earrings. She doesn't have them pierced yet, but I'm thinking we're getting close. Maybe four or five years old. We'll get that done whenever she decides to do it. So I think she likes this. She's really into dressing up. Okay. I know that these LOL balls are really popular, which there aren't any available anywhere. Not that I could find. Um, so this is like a charm fizz ball and i'm thinking what you do with it is it says you dunk in water for a surprise so you put it in water and then you find a surprise in there that's a lol surprise and then she has some bell sock and then she has some little gloves so all of this stuff is for my three-year-old almost four-year-old so next up is another girl her name is julia she is my second born and she and she is going to be nine at the end of this month so we try to not you know forget her in the mix so we have a special spa birthday planned for her in the beginning of well i think we're going to do it on her birthday at the end of this month that will be fun so this is what we have for julia first is this little bracelet like a charm bracelet she really likes to do her hair lately so here is some hair ponies and clips and bobby pins we have a emojis notebook she has an aerial towel so i know hatchimals are kind of popular and we haven't even got one yet but she's been interested in them so i got her some hatchimal stickers she really likes horses and so we haven't watched this yet um that spirit show on netflix have any of you i would love to know if it's good and if it's a good recommendation and so there's like a little horse in there she likes to bring purses everywhere now and so this is a little wristlet purse have some headphones we have an excavation kit and it's a seashell with something special find a treasure in there what else is in here okay i don't know why kids like these things but you know they have them at all the different types of stores but this is a surprise -a -mall. And there's like an animal in there, I guess. She has her toothpaste and toothbrush. And it's she's always wanted a battery-operated one. And maybe one day I'll invest in a better one. But this one's just from the Dollar Tree. And then she has the Jason fluoride-free toothpaste. Almost done. We have these emoji socks. These really cute sequence flip gloves that you can flip this part over to cover your fingers or have your fingers open. And lastly are some earrings. I don't know if any of your daughters have sensitive ears, but she, Julia does. She has to only wear sterling silver or like a precious metal like that. She can't wear even the nickel free or anything because she starts getting the scabs and stuff. So she's kind of allergic to it, I guess you could say. So she has these dangly earrings. She's been wanting dangly earrings. And last up is my oldest child my son lincoln and this is what i have in his stocking it is harder to do the stockings as they get older when they're little and it's like all the dollar tree stuff and that's awesome and great but when they're older it's like the same old stuff so we have to 
get some more and spend a little more but that's what I do I'm not saying that's what you have to do um so I'm going to show you what I got for him first step is this Rubik's Cube and he's been interested in these so I got him one of these he has a Star Wars little notebook it's just for paper nope he has some headphones what is in here he has a minions towel he has an excavation kit too and this one has a dino claw in it he really likes minecraft i got him these minecraft stickers okay we had an interruption nobody saw anything no good that's good he has a toothbrush and then he has this sea fresh tooth paste from Jason's. He has this Timex Iron Man watch and I got him this because next semester he's going to be at a homeschool co-op where he has to change classes on his own and he also has to go to a study hall in lunchtime and he'll have to know when to go and then go to the class. So I got him this so he can set a timer. And last up is these gloves. Just two pairs of black gloves. Well, I know that was a lot. I love just getting my kids all of those gifts and I hope that they love them and I know that they'll love them. I wanted to tell you real quick about the stockings. I actually ordered our family stockings before I knew I was gonna have a fourth baby and from a lady on Etsy and she did a wonderful job. These are gonna hold up through the years, very sturdy and just the perfect size because I don't want it any bigger. I already put enough in them, right? And then two years later, I guess, I had to order another stocking for this little man. And she did a perfect job. All the colors match up. I highly recommend her. The only thing, she does take a little long on her shipping. Other than that, great work. And um, I will leave a link below in case you wanted to check out her shop. Don't forget to check out the playlist below. There's going to be lots of different ladies sharing what they got their kids, husbands, or whoever, and what they put in their stockings. So make sure you check it out and go look, give those ladies some love. So you guys caught me right in the middle of Vlogmas, which is us sharing our lives every day until Christmas. And it's more of a vlog style than a sit down video. So I, I interrupted Vlogmas today to do this video. But I will link the playlist above in case you wanted to check out our vlogmas video. If you are new here, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And we will see you tomorrow in the vlogmas video. I hope that you guys have a Merry Christmas. Bye guys.